All right, I'm gonna be throwing my Champion Roadrunner this time. It uh, flips up straight, flies pretty flat. If it turns a little right, it'll get down there pretty good. It's a little light, but I like them that way. Robin and Matt both get unfortunate bogeys while Jamie takes a two-stroke lead to remain even. We're over halfway through the round. Let's move on to hole six. On hole six, it's a fairly straight shot and it fades off to the left. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw my disc and let it do its, let it do its thing. And I'm going to throw a destroyer again. Good work. Good. On this hole, I'm going to be throwing a uh, beat up Roadrunner. It's going to throw with some hyzer, have it flip up, and hopefully it'll continue to turn. I mean, I'll be, I'll, I've been searching for years for the elusive disc that's going to go straight and turn over at the end. As a lefty, it's kind of tough. We'll see what happens. I'm going to throw my uh, pro rate that's pretty beat, beat in. I throw this all the time. Uh, wooded courses like this, and French Creek, and knock a mix in. Uh, it will flip up straight. I'm hoping that it turns back a little left at the end. 172 grammar. Jamie lets the door back open just a bit as he bogeys this hole as Matt and Robin make par. Let's see if Matt and Robin can get another one back and tie it up as we move on to hole seven. But before we do, we'll take a quick break and be right back for more tag round action at the Unami Creek Disc Golf Course. And we're back for more tag action on hole seven. As Robin has the box and is behind Jamie by one stroke, 
with only three holes to go to see who can claim the number one LVDC tag at Nami Creek Park. Okay, this is hole seven. I'm gonna be throwing a road runner again. Uh, this hole goes straight and then it turns to the right, but up at the corner where you're the corner where you want to go around it, there's kind of like this jungle area. I don't want to be in there, so I want to make sure mine goes straight. I definitely want to throw straight here too, and also maybe go a little right. And I do mean a little, so I'm going to throw my DX sting right here. Not too many people throw these. Robin's one of them, but. It's a nice light one, about 170 grams for us old folks. Easy to throw uphill. I like that one. I'm going to throw a rock shot up about 300 feet, just a dead straight little one, little rock, uh, and then hope for my putt to come near or in on the second shot. Uh, it's a a midi rock. And after that, Robin holds on to a one-stroke deficit behind Jamie, while Matt falls behind both Jamie and Robin with another bogey as we move on to hole eight. 